keeping it quiet. Uh. I pull up, you know I be moving. Whipping the four and I'm cruising. The money I'm speaking the flu. This is the second date update on the 10 with Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa. The Get Up Crew. Hot 96.9. Hello, Cindy. How can we help you? Hi, I'm calling because I had a wonderful date with this guy that I really liked. And I just haven't heard from him again. First of all, I planned this date that was the bomb. We had we went out to the movies. We saw Godzilla. We saw John Wick for free. I mean, movies are very expensive, so that was like kudos to me. Okay. <laughs> and like we had a great time at the movies, but we also had we went to dinner and hello. I got us free apps and drinks for free. Do you understand how much drinks cost? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So I'm really lost. I'm at a loss right now because I don't understand why this app didn't call me back. Mm. Oh, I forgot to mention that the movie theater was a super luxe. Damn. Oh, I love okay. super luxe. Okay, so listen. Um, yes. Do you want me to call this guy to get you another date, or do you just want to go on a date with Melissa right now because her eyes, <laughs> she looks like a heart emoji right no, now. No, the super luxes are the best, man. Oh, getting in yes. two movies, you know, like the free apps, all that stuff. Okay, so now do you think, is there is there anything you think you might have done that turned the guy off? No, I mean, I'm the bomb, first of all, so I don't understand <laughs> well, why. Well, okay, then. Unless he's gay, that he didn't call me back. Oh, okay, then. Jeez. Okay, okay. Well, we'll find out. That'll be the first question I ask him. Because okay, that's the you. only reason. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll call him <laughs> next. Uh, that'll be just short and easy. What's the guy's name? Oh, Jesus. His name is Carter. Carter. Over there. Hey, is this Carter? Yeah. Are you gay? Yes. All right. Well, exactly. Thanks. Okay. Uh, okay. We'll call him next. Hang on. Second date update on the 10th. Now back to the second date update on the 10th. With Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa, the Get Up Crew. Hot 96.9. All right. So we just spoke to Cindy. Uh, according to her, she is the bomb. That's she, what she says. She can get hookups like a mother. She went on a date with this dude. They saw... Not one, but two movies mm -hmm. at a Super Lux. Mm -hmm. Then they went to dinner. She got free appetizers. Do you think you made one little mistake that night? Are you talking to me? Yeah. Uh, wow. Um, I mean, seriously, no. I mean, who gets free <laughs> stuff that's expensive like that on a first date? And I know what I have. Look, I know my worth, okay? Okay. I'm, I'm awesome. Okay. I believe Boy, this you, This is going to end well, I can tell. Yes. Okay, so stay quiet now. We're going to call Carter, and he's going to shit all over you. Hey, good morning. Hi, <clears throat> is this Carter? Yeah, yeah, who's this? Carter, are you gay? No, I'm only kidding. Uh, Carter, it's 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 Romero, <laughs> Pebbles, and <laughs> it's Romero, Pebbles, and Melissa calling from Hot 96.9. I... Night... Wait, 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 back up a second. You, you, somebody calling me from the radio to ask if I'm gay? <laughs> wait, no. 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 Well, kind of. No. Okay, so no, no, no. So listen, oh so God. we got a phone call from a girl who would like to take you out on a date. And and she she wanted us to offer you a free date. So, like, we'll let you pick the date, the place, the time, all that stuff. If you just agree. And I'm going to tell you who the girl is. So it's like, there's no tricks involved. What are we talking about? We're talking about Cindy, who you already went on a date with. Uh, 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 hmm. Yeah. <laughs> no. No, no. I... I I, I I already went out on one free date with Cindy. I don't think a I don't think a second one's gonna happen. Okay, cool. We talked to her and she said that you guys had a great time together. Yeah, everything was perfect. Yeah, she sounded like she sounded like she was telling us that she got hookups for movies, dinner, all that stuff. Yeah, oh yeah, she got the hookups all right. She's she's very well connected. Look, look, she she asks me out, right? We go she plans the whole night. She's got this in her back pocket. She takes me to a super luxe. The guy at the ticket door mm -hmm. knows her. We get in for free. All right. Perfect. Back to a bonus. After the movie, we go out. We get a steak. We get appetizers. It's getting stupid now. We're not even at the theater anymore. She knows these people, too. <laughs> Everything is free. So then I just ask her point out, just point blank. How are you getting all this stuff for free? How do you know all these people? Did are you like a drug dealer? And she says, nah, nah, nah. I used to f*** them. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah. No 
Right now you're in my shoes. You used to fuck every single one of them, like all at okay, once. And or the. Uh, uh, oh, oh, wait, hold on a second. Wait, wait. Okay, hold on. There's a lot going on right now. Uh, Carter, please uh, don't get angry, but Cindy's on the phone right now. Cindy. Yes. Of course she is. Of course I am, and I still don't understand why you didn't call me back. What's the big deal? Wait, hold on. Did you real? Were you joking when you said you fucked all those dudes? No. Why would I be joking? We all have dated before. How come it's good for men, but it's not good for women? I'm not saying that you shouldn't date. I'm just saying maybe you shouldn't have be so nonchalant on a first date talking about how you banged all these dudes that are hooking you up. Well, I, I honestly don't understand what the problem is. It's like if I see him and he's getting stuff for free, what's the big deal with that? So what? He f***ed that girl. Big deal. That was in the past. We're in the present, right? We're on a date now. I'm not f***ing him now. I, you I'm know, Carter, I, first of all, you weren't too sad, first of all, when we were getting into that movie theater watching two movies for free. You weren't sad eating that popcorn stuffing your face, okay? I know, then, because you weren't okay. sad when you were stuffing your mouth with the c*** either. They got us those things. It was a little too much. Oh, oh, okay. Oh so it's God. okay, first of all, it's okay for you as a man to go out and f*** whatever woman you want. But for me, I'm dating too. I can't f*** a man. Listen, listen, listen. That That's fine. I just don't want to meet five guys you f*** on our first date. That's, so you basically want to be lied at. to. You want me to lie to you. I was trying to be honest on our first date, but obviously you just want to be lied to. Like... Everybody no, 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 Cindy. I, it's not that I want to be lied to. It's that I want the truth to be something else. <laughs> and oh, with God. someone else. Oh, my God. Oh, that's the best line I've ever I heard. I want the oh, truth God. to be something else. <laughs> Wow. Oh, God. That was wow. amazing. <laughs> Carter, is that no to another date with Cindy or? Yeah, that's a, that's a no to oh another God. date with Cindy. I think that's fair. That's really fine with are, me. Are, are you sure? Because oh. this one, you don't have to worry about, like, we'll, we're going to pay for the date. So, you oh, know. yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. She's going to come down and f*** you all, too. It's going to happen. <laughs> okay. Don't worry. Tomorrow on the second date update on the 10. This poor son of a bitch, Ralph, man. He- of his job so he can help out Erin at her job. And now she's not calling him. But he didn't mess up. What the hell did he do? You're going to find out tomorrow morning at 710 with us. Romero, Pebbles, and Melissa, the get-up crew. Hi.